Hello everybody and welcome to my e-lesson. I'm your guru and in this video I'll tell you how to manage text and images in MS Word and they can be handled so very well. Let me show you an example. So this is an image that I've inserted over here. See how I move the image and how the text automatically is adjusting around it. There are quite a few ways of doing it and I have listed them all down. Microsoft offers one, two, it's called in line with text, square, tight, behind text, in front of text, top and bottom and many more. I'll explore them with you right now. So, but it looks so very cool that the text automatically adjusts itself according to the size of the image. All right, so now I've already taught you how in, in an earlier video how to insert an image. Now we learn how to insert images and text together so that they gel along okay so uh, to do that what we need to do is we need to click on the image and the format tab shows up over from here we need to click on the wrap. Need to click on the wrap text tab the first one is in line with text it actually just simply treats the image as a part of a as a of the text so the movement isn't that simple of the image and the text does not adjust itself and then there are the other options which I showed. This, this, uh, this option, first of all, is usually helpful when you want the image to be in a fixed place. And then comes the square option. This aligns the text in a perfectly square manner around, in an, ob obvious, in a, in an approximately square manner around the image. And then there are variations to the same thing. This is tight which tries to pack in as much text closer to the image as possible and then there is through this is another variation of the text being packed closely with the image I like this one also top and bottom the text is cleanly divided between uh, lines and the image is inserted cleanly between two lines there are other options also behind text wherein the image image goes behind the text in front of text wherein the image comes in front of text and more important more option layouts go to text wrapping and choose other other options you will love them all right so just just try them out and uh, write your experiences in the comment section right okay so i hope you like this video and do not forget to download this file because I have given a very good description of what each feature does over here. So feel free to download it from myelesson.org. This file is free and until the next video, this is your guru signing off for the day. Have a wonderful day ahead. Happy learning.